trying to record a video here, you know? What up world, it's Trent from Twelve's Health and Fitness and today we're taking a look at our deltoids. So let's check out the anatomy first and then I'll meet you back on the floor right here. The deltoids are muscles that act on the shoulder joint of the human body. The deltoid group is split into three separate heads. These heads are the anterior deltoid, the lateral deltoid, and the posterior deltoid. The deltoids are located at the top of the shoulder joint and each of the heads have their own separate origin points. The muscles join together as one tendon and insert on the humerus. The anterior deltoid is located on the interior portion of the shoulder, which is the front of the shoulder. Its origin point is located on the clavicle. The lateral deltoid is located on the lateral portion of the shoulder between the anterior and posterior deltoid. Its origin point is located on the scapula. And finally, the posterior deltoid is located on the posterior portion of the shoulder, which is the rear of the shoulder. Its origin point is also located on the scapula. The anterior, lateral, and posterior muscle fibers join together as one tendon and inserts on the upper lateral portion of the humerus. See, I told you I'd be back right here. Anyways, what do the deltoids do? Well, each deltoid serves its own action on the shoulder joint. All right, so the action of the anterior deltoid is shoulder flexion, transverse adduction, and medial rotation. The action of the lateral deltoid is abduction of the shoulder, which is raising it up to your side. And finally, the action of the posterior deltoid is extension of the shoulder, which is behind the body. We also have transverse abduction, which is behind the body as well, and lateral rotation. All right, so now we want to exercise our deltoids. Well, for the anterior deltoid, we can do front raises. Front raise, just out in front. For the lateral deltoid, we're going to want to use lateral raises. We're going to want to have a slight lean into it so our deltoid is actually facing the ceiling. We'll come up sideways. And finally, to hit the posterior deltoid, we can do straight on reverse flies. You're going to need an extreme lean into this one or you can use a bench. So those are three basic exercises to target each head of the deltoids. Okay, now it's time to stretch them. For your anterior deltoid, what you want to do is you want to put your elbow and arm behind your back and try and reach up as high as you can. Push your chest forward and bring this elbow backwards. Just like this. Remember, you want to hold this for 30 to 60 seconds and you want to be just below your pain threshold. All right, for the lateral deltoid, what you want to do is you want to reach across your chest. You want to take your other hand, put it on your elbow, push into your chest, and then pull it across your chest. Remember again, you want to hold this stretch for about 30 to 60 seconds, just below your pain threshold. And finally, to stretch the posterior deltoid, it's kind of the same position for the lateral deltoid. However, this hand is going to be underneath the stretching arm. So what we're going to want to do is come underneath it just like this. You're going to want to push in. You want to drag it across and up, and you want to lean into it a little bit. Remember to hold this for 30 to 60 seconds, just below your pain threshold. Where did I put my phone? Wow. Oh, you guys are still here. Wow. If you guys could do me a huge favor by liking the video and leaving a comment down below, it'd be greatly appreciated. And subscribe for more content. Until next time, see you later.